理科って言ってしまうとどうしてもその学習っていう色合いが強くなると思うんですけれどももう少し広い視点で必要性を考えていくことが大切なんじゃないかなと思っています。Nurturing children's power to shape the future. The people of Hitachi. In recent years, children's interest in science has been shrinking. As science classes become harder to understand with symbols and complex equations, their interest begins to fade away. There are concerns that this growing trend may eventually cause a talent shortage in scientific fields. Hitachi High Tech has long supported science education to fight this issue. One of those efforts is outreach classes. Instructors from Hitachi High Tech. Bring tabletop electron microscopes to elementary and junior high schools where students can observe various samples. Allowing students to experience the microscopic world helps spur their interest in science. Amiko Nihei. She works as an instructor for these outreach classes. She plans lessons, makes arrangements with schools, and collects samples. Children, that is, the future of the world, will be shaped by the way they live in the future. The scientific work is an important thing to live in the future. I think it is important to have such things in their own mind and to have such things in their own mind. I think it is important to have such things in their own mind. This idea goes back to Amiko's childhood. She was the kind of child who, upon receiving a wristwatch, would disassemble it and put it back together by herself. In college, she majored in chemistry and researched archaeological relics. Then she began working at an analysis equipment maker. Wanting to convey the fun of science to children, She decided to work at the National Museum of Emerging Science and Innovation. Through this experience, Amiko learned the importance of making science easy to understand. She went on to build a career in communicating information about various fields, including food and healthcare. Then, one day, her son in elementary school said, Amiko wanted to return to her roots and teach the fun of science to children, and joined Hitachi High Tech in 2020. 本当は企業での,この理科教育支援のような CSR の活動をしたかったし、まあ、私自身もその分析機器っていうものがものすごく好きだったのでやっぱり心のどこかにそこに戻りたいっていう気持ちもあって。But despite her enthusiasm, the COVID-19 pandemic struck. It became difficult to conduct outreach classes directly with children. このその理科の出前授業っていうものがもうできないんじゃないかとか、実際じゃあ現場の先生と調整をしてリモートの授業をやるってなったときに、まあどんな困難が待っているのか。However, Amiko didn't give up. Using software to remotely control microscopes, she overcame each issue one by one, including internet connection problems at local schools. Finally, she was ready to conduct outreach classes online. After a bumpy start, 
The online outreach classes are now yielding results a year and a half after Amiko joined. Amiko is also a mother of four. Making use of her own experience as a mother, Amiko will continue to nurture children's power to shape the future. Amiko's 